Hey everyone, uh, welcome back to my workbench. Um, as always, I have yet another camera set up to play with today. Um, but anyway, this is... I'm still working on the Nomad here. I'm trying to figure out a spot for the controller one. And from what I've seen online, everyone seems to put it just off to the right of the uh, controller two port. Uh, which is pro looks like it's about the only spot you can practically put it. So what I'm gonna have to do is I'm gonna have to cut off uh, the standoff here. So I'm gonna take it over to my uh, end mill, cut that standoff off, standoff off, okay, and uh, cut a D-shaped hole here in the housing, uh, so it'll kind of sit about here. Well, it's gonna be. Uh, I'll see if I can. I'll bump it out a little bit, mount it more or less flush with the surface. Uh, I'll just throw a nut or two in there just to space it up. Um, just throw, there'll just be a couple of uh, screws on the outside that keep it from moving around. Uh, so it'll sit down here. But yeah, from what I've seen online, that's about the only spot you have because I tried over I'm working with the fitment here. And if you try to do it here, there's plenty, it looks like there's plenty of space here, but the height of the connector, uh, you can see how this surface here is a good uh, 200 thou higher, and there's, you just don't have enough room for the connector. Um, maybe over here way on the left, I'll look one more time before I cut any plastic, but um, that is, let's see, can it go over there? trying to figure this out here so it could theoretically go over there as well and sit yeah but I'm not sure if it really matters I'm probably gonna end up going over here just because there's more room to work with uh, it's gonna be cutting it really close to this connector here which I'm not I don't want to come in on this guy too much so yeah, I probably could. It's gonna be it'd be close though, since that sits there. Yeah. Hmm. So either it's gonna go over there or if it's gonna go over here. This is would be nice just because you'd have the two controller ports next to each other. And yeah, aesthetically I think this would work better over here. Um, and it's right by the brightness knob which isn't really going to be used for anything anymore anyway so I'll cut that cold hole for that down there and that should look pretty nice um, yeah from the other mods I've seen um, it's in the exact same spot over here so there's got to be a reason for it no use uh, reinventing the wheel here so I'm gonna start cutting some plastic in a minute I uh, also took off the spare screen that was over here. So that's going to get reused for some other project. Um, but for now, I'm going to uh, start cutting some plastic and start reassembling. And I also need to find out where in the world I'm going to fit in this uh, boost converter in here. I think I have a little room on the underside of this board uh, probably end up putting it uh, let's see it's luckily it's pretty low profile but you have plastic standoffs in here for so it's probably going to end up nestled down in this region would be my guess uh, i'll find a spot for it and the problem is there's like a shield that goes over this whole thing so i have to cut this mount the converter in there and then I think I might do all the modifications to the bottom case and have the switch for the uh, screen up here right next to where the uh, power switch is at. So I'll have the DC in and I'll have the power switch right there. So if you want to switch it on, if you want to turn the screen off, I'll just have the button right there for it. So it's off to some cutting some plastic and reassembling. So uh, this is a short one from now. I might have an update later this evening. I'm not sure yet. 
Uh, but I'm going to cut some plastic, and uh, next time I, updates, you sh I have an update, you should see uh, some parts reassemble in here. And uh, looking good so far. So thanks for watching.